Hello and welcome back to Super Mario Bros. 3. Where were we at on this? Right. Sort of coming back to me. Okay, uh, I don't remember what's going on in this level at all, but I remember a lot of pain. So let's see if we can just... play real serious and uh, circumvent that. Okay, so then these, these, these blocks. Alright, no big deal. Just wait for this guy to be over there and then... A little bit of a big deal. Ah, I choked. It's not that big of a deal, but I just I choked. Probably the farthest I've been. Right? Did I get there before? Okay, I'm not sliding down that. Don't invite me to have fun. The fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god. Okay. Jesus Christ. Okay. Right, I was just doing that for completion's sake, wasn't I? Wow, nice. Uh, okay, so... Is this path... Or no? I came in a different way. What's this? What is this? I don't remember this world well at all right now. <coughs> this is just the other pipe. Okay. Sweet. Important. Good shit. Okay. Fine. I just instinctively hit my save state button that doesn't work with the simulator because I have a different one when I'm doing long plays and I'm just like... Basically what I'm trying to say is uh, my butt is clenched and uh, the rest of this world is uh, pretty intimidating and I just want some toad houses. Like I'm sure I won't lose 46 lives honestly, but... but it might make me suffer. A lot of repeated deaths along the way, if we're not careful here. Okay, so I don't fucking remember this castle at all, except hatred for it, in a vague sense. Um, Jesus, what am I supposed to do with any of this? Was I supposed to have a, like, a P-switch then? Because I can't do shit in this room with the blocks like this. Okay, all right. Man, I hate this stage. There was one like this in Rainbow Realms, and I think it was just a, uh... Okay, so this is a fire flower, right? Not a, yeah, not a tail. And I think uh, I get how it was mechanically not as original as I thought it might have been with the, with the math. I think it might have just been, uh clever using of, uh, this general castle. That's just a, a feeling, I'm not sure. It kind of seems like it would work, doesn't it? I don't know where I'm supposed to be going at all, but... This seems fine. I don't know, keep going to the right, or door. Going to the right is, uh, is victory in a general way, so let's just do that. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? I've decided I think it's this door. Objectively, I just do. anymore is that bad. Go 
Okay, all right, fine. Didn't go right, right far enough. All right. Oh my god, okay. All right, let's just keep going as far as we can then. Okay, right, so, right, right. So this is the uh, the real true right, right? Oh, I think that's important. Oh God. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Hidden power up. Cool. Nice design. If this is, in, in fact, the true right in the end of the line. Fuck. I guess there was P- Okay, never mind. I can not fuck. Unfuck, because I can get infinite P-switches. That's fine. Then. Is this sweet, sweet victory? I don't think it is. I think that was, uh, you're gonna run out of, uh, time, pity life. Okay, so there's a lot of things that can be P-switched in that room. Jesus Christ, this level is atrocious. Um, I have nothing. <clears throat> Sweet. Yeah, clouds suck. Um... there's an early power up easily you know it only gives me 400 seconds so I, I feel like it can't be too complicated despite how it's coming across okay wait a second I think I get it I think it's wait how do I get out of this oh, okay maybe son of a bitch Oh, that's how this room is supposed to be played. I get it. That makes a lot of sense. That's pretty cool. But yeah, I feel like uh, I figured out the, the simple version of this. Uh, oh, I should have gone through that door. Simple version just being that you have to have the power up to proceed. And then just go to the right, probably. I mean, I don't know for sure about going to the right, but like here you need the, the mushroom, at least two do that, and then later. It just seems like a lot of, uh, tail meeting. This, this has to be basically forward, right? Like, I just have to keep the tail longer. There was more to tail smack. Not in here, but through the door. Is that right? I think. Oh, right. Okay, because anything that I uh, don't get with the P-switch. Right. Okay. Actually disqualifies me from moving forward. That's a power up. All right, I get it. I get it. Level. <clears throat> That's well put together. It protects you, so you have to actually make it up oh, the first time and not fuck it up. But I could have offset that by getting that power up. Oh, shit. All right. This is lame. Interesting how you could get a fire flower on top if you wanted it for some reason. I guess it's just so you could get a mushroom as well. Damn it. I was trying really hard to uh, leave enough time to just barely squeak back through the bottom, if possible. I 
guess I could have jumped under then, too, technically, and then the leaf would have come down. That could have been neat, but oh well. That's not what infinite P switches are for. Okay, so... Where do I want to go with this new wonderful ability, then? I guess all the way to the left? victory, or is this literally backwards? This feels very backwards, but I, I don't think I've seen it, so... I'm cooking now. Okay. Yeah, that looks like I went through it the correct direction. Uh, okay. Alright. Uh, this, this way is fine. That's not what I want. I've seen where that goes. Right, I think. I don't know, I guess I gotta do it. I got nothing else to do. Yeah, like, who cares, man? Oh my god. Where am I supposed to go, then? This episode is just gonna be this level, because I have absolutely no fucking idea what's going on here. This, like, seems like the penultimate part of it, right? And yet, I see no way... Oh, shit. ...to continue... Okay, have I tried this door? Okay, so that side was the triangle, so I... Yeah, this is nothing. God damn it. It's alright, I've got ten whole seconds, I'll be fine. supposed to do here? Okay, so have I ever gone in this door just to see? Oh, this is sweet. This seems fine. Maybe I come back to that with a power-up, though? Maybe I use that door to refresh that power-up, actually? Sure hope so, now. Yeah, okay. I'm sure it's just gonna be a fire flower, but... That'll protect us from the lava, right? Because we're fire Mario. That makes complete sense, disregard anything you've ever heard or seen otherwise. SMB3! Okay, so... Have I... Okay, so this is... Yeah, this isn't anything special, this is just a thwomp. But, have I ever been right of the Thwomp? I mean, I probably have with a pipe, right? What else is out here? <sighs> That's not what I want at all. Okay, then. Alright, new strategy of just literally trying every door, and something's gotta go somewhere that I don't recognize well. Okay, so have I ever gone to the... Yeah, I have. I've gone this way before, I think. Uh, but only through the magic of other doors. God damn it. Alright, so now... I don't know if there's any behind me here that I haven't done, so we're just gonna... That's not what I meant to do. I, I just meant to go part the way back, not... Back into the ground, but... 
That's alright. I used to know how to get a power up right at the beginning in a big brain way I hadn't thought of before. I can actually get right in there with the, uh, what the fuck's it called? Uh, the raccoon tail. Do actually come to think of it, like I don't. Let's not even mess with the fire flower. Definitely precarious to get, but you get to start with what you want, so. Well, uh, okay, never mind. Forgot I could just break through the ceiling there. I guess I'm just trying every door to the right of this. See, I, I did that one, and then this one, yeah, so. No, not that one. What is this? Just a two sided level that has a lot of options to change in between? Okay, alright. This is not different. Never seen it from this side before. Looks nice over here. Okay, so... <sighs> there wasn't something else this way, was there? Uh... What? That's how you beat that castle. Always has been, always will be, uh, the official strat. Nice. Took that castle down. Uh, what's in this pipe? This doesn't look like a helpful direction to go in. Hey, look, it's a vista. And again, we're going uphill. What are we doing? Sweet, nice. I'm sure that I've seen this, and I just have no memory of it right now, so that happens. What can you do but slide down some hills? Because you, you know, you gotta get something for the effort of going up them. Another, it's just another pipe. Okay, so this is in the final area, I think, then. Bowser's a uh, little core area. Yeah. Nice. I always love this map. Probably just because it's at the end of the game, but it's, it's cool, it's small, and uh, it has tank fleets on it. It's amazing. Uh, I wonder... I think I can put them the, the tank to sleep. I don't know if I'm going to pass it, if I can, but I just want to see. No? Okay, well then I just gave a, uh, a wonderful sound remap to the, the last world then. Very different, energetically. Alright, well, let's go uh, jump on it. Let's go jump on some fucking tanks. eight tanks, so their armaments actually pretty well work together in horrifying ways, rather than just being here and there. And yet, all it takes is a firm bounce to most of them, to, to take them out. Not even a, a large bounce, just a, a good, firm bounce. Can't even say from a portly plumber man, because it's basically a plumber child right now. It's just having the decency to not cry about what it has to do. I 
think I can get a one up there. I think I, I think the 99 is still possible. <laughs> But, I mean, what have I got to lose except viewers? <laughs> oh, it's so possible. It's so possible. How many is it for 1-Up? Is it... Is 6 a 1-Up? I have no idea. Or is 8? Bullshit. Okay. All right. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe the timing is a little bit tighter than uh, I can actually manage. Had to try though, right? Oh, it's so possible. Okay, I'm not gonna like grind it anymore, but I'm so trying it every time I die. brain's resources on uh, acknowledged and you exist again. So, uh, yeah, didn't, didn't, didn't quite come out with 99. Darn close. So close. Anyway, let's go jump on Bowser as a child. I hate those statues. Like, they're really cool, and I also hate them. I have no idea, like, exactly how they fire. And, I don't know, they just, it, it disturbs me every time I have to go past them when I have, uh, like, few lives or I'm trying to do, uh, a no-death run, and, uh, this time isn't really either, but, but it's still kind of high stakes, I guess. There's something else, oh yeah, it's over to the right, okay. There's a, uh, split path over here, and then there's a power-up, and I always get this power-up, and then it just, like, ruins any ability that I have to actually do the run with any kind of, like, expediency, um, because I always end up dying a bunch of fucking times on the way back, so we're gonna see if that holds, <sighs> because of shit like this, it's just like, how am I supposed to do this jump from this angle? I'm not, it wants me to fucking go around again. I mean, that jump is actually, you have to have a certain amount of run speed, and then you have to do the dot jump there. But nice. And then you get lasered in the fucking shins, and you lose it all. Maybe. Maybe. What? Bring it on, fireballs. Okay, just that one. Just that one, okay, you liar. Just that one until I move forward. Well played. Gotta, gotta save those fireballs up. Can't just set them on a random pattern. Huh. All right, so uh, this is Bowser in Super Mario Bros. 3, if you've ever seen it before, which uh, has 
unique music, and uh, his music that I, I personally have a deep love for because I always uh, thought of this music as being Super Mario RPG, uh, starting Bowser level music, and uh, I didn't notice until later that in fact I had seen it, well, seen it, heard it before here. So you just get him to do that, you know, he's a, he's a good old fashioned classic Olmec type and uh, then you just jump around in celebration and recklessly jump back and forth over the hole and try to land right on that but not not before so it makes it even more likely you'll fall in and just do a lot of celebrating and show them what for and then what a peach what a peach Son of a bitch. I didn't remember that it actually said that in the classic. Like, I'm playing... Like, it, it made me pause and made me think I was playing a ROM hack. I'm definitely not. So yeah, then there's a little credits run at the end. And you get to see miniaturized versions of all the, uh, the maps. Very cool for something of its time. I mean, you've seen some of the worst credits around if, uh, if you've ever watched AVGN or listened to uh, lots of other people bring it up, sometimes in reference and sometimes on their own. Credits can be, uh, congratulations, period. And that's good. That's the good version of what they can be. It's worse. Some games put it more. Some games are the best selling on the console. Today I'd say that this is really worth playing for anyone who uh, just wants to play SMB3 the way that it originally was. Mario Maker is great. I love that they've added new palettes and new kinds of items to the SMB3 graphic like palette. And, uh, a lot of creative things there, but it's not the same thing as the original level set or the original physics. And uh, then you can go explore ROM hacks if you want after that, and you can see uh, the deep end of the customization for Mario. I've done a uh, randomized run of this on the channel as well if you're interested in more SMB3. Go check that out if you haven't seen it already and it sounds interesting to you. It's just a uh, randomizer program shuffling this original set and uh, supposedly adding some other little things, but they kind of are hit and miss on how they actually work out. But go check it out and you can download it in its description if you want. And then go check out the Fire Orb Mod Museum channel if you want to see some ROM hacks of this where I just do long plays out of a commentary but you can find the downloads and uh, see the entire thing played through if that sounds interesting. So, thanks for joining me for SMB3, and uh, have a good one. Uh, join me back for something else later. We'll play something else to pass some more time. Peace out.